into the airport early morning for a keynote I have tomorrow in Hilton Head for the AGC of the Carolinas. I did my first national AGC event in 2019. And since then, I've done more than a dozen gigs from people who were in that audience. It's a great reminder to me that doing great work is what leads to future work. And uh, it's something that is on the top of my mind every time is if I do a good job, then people in this audience should want to bring me to other events that they're part of. It's on me to tell interesting stories, share the science behind sustained excellence, and hopefully move the people in this audience to action to better their lives, both at home and at work. Excited to get down there. The last thing I do before a speech is write the notes of my talk but I never want to be beholden to the technology working. So I will put this small piece of paper in my back pocket. And just a reminder to myself to go for it. I think the best keynotes in the world are the ones who decide to give everything they have to this moment. And that's what I'm about to do as I go on stage. Just landed in Dayton, reflecting back on my speech for the great leaders of AGC of the Carolinas. There's a moment uh, at the end of every speech where this informal line starts to form towards the side of the stage. Sometimes it's to sign books, but usually it's just to have a brief conversation. People who were moved by your talk want to meet you and tell you a little bit more about themselves. And it's one of my favorite things about this work is getting to hear the stories of people from all over the world that I'm fortunate enough to meet. And there was one guy yesterday, he was waiting patiently. I could see he wanted others to go first. He shook my hand and he quietly said, I really needed this. Thank you. I really needed this. And uh, you could tell in his eyes that he didn't tell me exactly what it was that had moved them or why he needed it, but just that he did. And those words and that feedback means the world to me. So I leave the trip grateful and excited, pumped to continue to do this and excited to meet more people like that guy who said, I really needed this.